Got a chance to meet. Pink sweats. NYV. Like, why? I'm already mad that we have to leave. problem already and we haven't even been here for five minutes and we're just kind of like already mad hey what's up everybody good uh well af afternoon it's 122 welcome to my youtube channel in the afternoon you guys already know where we're going when you see a hat like this outside the door no we're going to los cabos we are going to be joined by friends um that you guys haven't met yet enrique and Bridget Josephs. And Ricky and Bridget. Yeah, they're, they're awesome friends of ours. And Enrique is also a voice actor, so that's what we share in common. But anyway, we're excited to do this. And uh, yeah, it's going to be the bomb. It's going to be the bomb. All right, see you in a bit. Sorry, I didn't know. I was about to get comfy. Honestly, I'm so excited. This is... Yo. We are in Los Cabos, Mexico. We saw the Josephs too. They're behind us, I think. No? Nope. Or they're, they're probably in front of us, I think. I don't know. They made it safe and time. Margaritas with mango and bacon margarita with it's like, why? I'm already mad that we have to leave. <laughs> we're having a problem already and we haven't even been here for five minutes and we're just kind of like already mad that we have to leave later this week. We have to stay in the moment. I might miss my flight. Can we talk about missing her flight? My God. Yo, we cannot. This is crazy, man. Look at this place. I mean, I... It's insane. I cannot believe it, I, but I'm glad we're here. Now that I get to share this with my wife. My amazing wife. I'm so excited. So excited, man. We get to freaking see whales. Yeah, there's whales over there, y'all. I'm over it. Over. Whales over there. It's, it's insane. Look at them. Could you imagine going to sleep to this? You just open the door. Maybe that's how we're going to sleep. And just hear the crashing waves. Ah. Okay, we got to get ready for dinner. And uh, let's get ready. Yo, that. Do you want to do like some chips or something on the table? Uh, it's up to y'all. That's what you want. Ah, you should put it back up. This is this is the place to do it. Yeah. This this is it. This is this is. Oh, it comes with that. So as we're eating dinner. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta keep it going. Why there's a big gap is because I got a chance to meet Pink Sweats and YV. Well, soon to be wifey. Soon to be wifey. Day out yet? I mean, we shouldn't say the day out yet. I'm probably like that, yeah. I'll cut it. Don't worry about it. I'll cut it. True, it's true. Coming, coming to you this summer. Coming soon. We've been having a great time talking about how um, life in America is these days. <laughs> we talk about how we found out about this place. <laughs> <laughs> the new movie. How did you find out about this place? Yes, copyrighted already, so let me try it. Right, right, right. Yeah, it's been really dope. Day one is done, and tomorrow we got. What are we doing tomorrow? Camelback riding? Uh, sunset sunset cruise. Oh, oh, sunset cruise, the sailing thingy. It's, yeah. It sounds great, though. I'm yeah. Scared. That water be wild. Yeah, it is wild. Well, in the daytime, maybe, yeah, I, I think, think it's Oh, maybe it's more yeah, chill. Like, yeah. That's why they were trying to get us to go mad early, because we wanted to go jet ski, and they were like, 8 a.m.? I was like, ooh, it's a vacation. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> Thank you. Hey, she it's said 8 a.m. Yeah, they were like, this is school. <laughs> but for me, it wasn't that. I was kind of late. I was up already, like, five. Well, isn't, like, the time yeah, supposed was, to be higher yeah, at yeah, night? Yeah, that's, yeah, why, that's why. Yeah. 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 Oh my gosh, man. 
like, yo, I cannot express how beautiful it is over here. So uh, last night we had a great time. Sorry, I didn't get the chance to vlog a lot of stuff that was going on last night. Uh, just because I was trying to be present and in the moment. It's Sometimes it's difficult to do that when you are vlogging and stuff like that. So one of the things that Karina and I always do when we go to some of these spots is we always look for people that look like us. Uh, younger people, black folks, um, Hispanic, just, you know, people that are kind of in the same, if not age range, complexion. You know what I'm saying? So, so we were talking about that, literally as we're talking about that. An artist by the name of Pink Sweats, uh, a lot of you guys may know, I'm sure a lot of you guys know him, he's incredible. I'm a, fa I'm a huge fan of his work. He comes sitting down behind us and we're trying not to freak out, right? We're like, what the heck is going on? And so we don't say anything, we're trying to play it cool. Because in places like this, right, like celebrities, artists, they go to spots like this to be away from the hubbub of somebody trying to ask for a picture or somebody... You know, all that stuff. So we're sitting there trying to play cool. We're eating our food, having a good time. And then Pink walks over and it's like, hey, what you guys order? And we're like, uh, you know, kind of stuck. But we let him know. And he's like, cool, I think I'm going to order that. And then he goes back to his table. And then we get done eating. So we're probably like the last, some of the last people there. And he just comes up. He's like, hey, I just want to, you know, ask you guys where you guys from. And, and you know, now he's talking to us. We're open the conversation. And then we get so far in the conversation, he's like, you know what, I'm just gonna pull up a chair and sit down. And so he sits down right next to us and we're eating and we're having a good time talking and stuff. And we were there for like three hours just having a conversation. Um, and so it's it's crazy, man, the type of people you'll meet. And, and we had a great time. He's hilarious. We just laughed like three hours because he has such a great sense of humor. And um, yeah, it was amazing, man. It was amazing. Sorry, <laughs> it's a tribe. <laughs> Dreams are made of. Look over there, y'all. I should have got my ND filter. Yo, man, this is amazing. If anybody, you get a chance to do something like this, you gotta do it. Unlike anything I've ever done before. We've, got, we've been on boat, on boat before, but nothing like this. Good vibes, good people. We're just blessed. Man. Just blessed. On your way down, at the end, just follow Sarah. She's gonna take care of you in the pictures. She's gonna take you back to the shuttle, and this is it. This is not a good bag. This is a sissy. What happened? Very white. Oh, see, lion. Okay, this is not a good bag. This is a sissy. God bless you all. Hasta la vista, baby. Sunset sailing, man. That was amazing. One of those things, man, you just gotta do. So we're about to get to dinner and uh, end the night, but we feel good. It's so relaxing, amazing experience. And there's more. Thank you. Wow. I love it. Why did I go? Sorry. It is morning time. I did a horrible job of vlogging yesterday at night. Uh, we went to the restaurant after the sailing, sunset sailing stuff. Uh, it was dinner at this place called Toro. The vibe was really dope. You know, one of the cool things, surprises of this trip is hanging out with a couple you didn't really expect to hang out with. I'm a fan of their work, and so, you know, we just went from chopping it up a little bit at the restaurant you know, on night one, yes, Sunday, to becoming good friends, you know, and hanging out. It's been really cool. It's kind of a surprising friendship there, uh, just because, you know, 
him being a celebrity and everything, you know, you know, you realize people are people, you know, they're, they're people and um, they don't mind getting a connection and, and growing a connection in a relationship with other people. So as long as it's not crazy or on some funny stuff. But it was definitely fun. Definitely fun. I wanted to show you guys what I'm working with voiceover wise, voiceover gear wise um, for this travel. Um, it's very nothing like really nothing impressive is actually I would not suggest doing it this way but um, I've kind of you know I've kind of I, I just decided I'm gonna do it this way and it is gonna be what's gonna be trying to really prioritize me enjoying having a great time instead of trying to figure out what frequency the room is in so that I can record f quietly it's gonna be what's gonna be Sennheiser 416 is right up and what is what allows me to to do that I mean, I've got my laptop here. Um, this runs Logic, uh, Logic Pro, and I'm also able to read my script and record at the same time. Oh, going into that, that Logic is my Volt 76. I've been really enjoying this little thing, man. Um, it kind the great thing about it is it's a universal audio product. Um, and it's literally plug and play like there is no nothing crazy about it. No, no loading. No, whatever It just literally you plug it in and it works um, If any of you guys have worked with the Scarlett 2 i2 in terms of how just quick it gets up and going then um, You'll be very much at uh, used to this kind of workflow currently going into that my microphone is being powered by it um, and that mic, as I told you guys in one of my videos when I was re reviewing mic, is my Sennheiser 416. Um, and the reason why I love this thing, again, is because it's super directional. I can pretty much be anywhere and record and it not be... I mean, you will still hear the room. That's one of the things that you got to keep in mind. You will continue to hear the room, but it's uh, it's not horrible. It's it's not horrible. Um, it's it, it gets the job done. And then you have my headphones dt 770s um and i'm trying to actually find smaller ones now like something even more portable um i know you guys are probably like man you're trying to literally get back to <laughs> nothing i almost want to get to the point where i can re just record on my cell phone <laughs> like that's how minimal i want to travel when it comes to voiceover nowadays i used to be super heavy and like i need this gear i need that 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 and now i'm like i need whatever can get the job done that's my setup man and as i'm recording all i see are the waves to keep me calm while i read i read sunscreen i put sunscreen on this on this how are you feeling better i had a hard time mm -hmm. sleeping but i feel mm -hmm. a little better so we went on vacation a couple of years ago a couple of deacons with my and, and my parents we were all staying in the same hotel room, had like three rooms. And he got like really sunburned. The next day, Bridget and I are chilling in our room and all we hear is like all the screaming. Oh no. Because like she had just like slapped the aloe, the cold aloe on yeah. the and all you hear is ah! He's screaming. <laughs> and we and Bridget are like, what is going on? <laughs> Death is what's going on. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. 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 That food was great though. Yeah, it was awesome. Solid. And then we're gonna go driving next to the beach. So I'm excited.
excited, y'all. This is gonna be sick. No bruises yet, right? I was gonna say she's hanging on. Yeah. I'm starting to drift in. And I hear Brittany go, go! Because the bush is like right there. And he turned to laugh. Boy, you can drive. Boy, you can drive. All I said was Tokyo drive. Hotel, but Cactus Tours it was amazing. We had a great time. Did some work, and now I'm in the shower. And then we're gonna grab din some dinner at a new spot, Estrella, right? Las Estrellas. Las Estrellas. Well, the stars. That's what we're gonna be eating today. So. Cause we stars. Cause we stars or whatever. But all right. Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. You look pretty. You sleepy? <laughs> your, yeah. your hair is all frizzy right now. Looking good, Joseph's looking good. <laughs> Got that on camera. <laughs> oh, no, no. <laughs> it was so so precious. <laughs> Eat on his face was like, I am here to serve you, and then you fly away into the wind. I love it. I love it. <laughs> So these are little things that they leave in our rooms. Every time we leave, they, they come in and clean our room up. It's amazing. Like, And they leave these. So what is it called, baby? So this is the sailor. Uh -huh. These are some Alcatraz flowers. <clears throat> and this is the canastera, yeah. a little basket lady. And this is the pineapple lady, la piñera. I love it. We're gonna put it on our-, on our um, Little shelves. Shelves at the, at the house. Hey. Good morning, everybody. I don't know what the date is. It's Thursday. <laughs> and um, we leave in a couple days. And it is, I don't even want to say bittersweet. Bittersweet would mean that we kind of want to go home. And that's just not the truth. I mean, we want to, <laughs> we want to stay here as long as we can. Given the status of our funds, we're not able to make this a long-term situation yeah i i was uh posting some things on my instagram the place or whatever people would message me and like you know one day i want to you know do what you're doing and go have a good time and vacation and it seems like you're going all over the place and, and traveling and stuff and i'm like i want to make something clear i'm not traveling all the time i'm not on different flights back to back you know you know this month we're going here this month we're going there that's not what we do um, we have a few trips a year. I say a couple of trips a year. We at first, Karina and I wanted to do like one big trip per year, and then for whatever reason, it's turned into a couple of big trips per year. I think because of the pandemic, it's kind of like kept us locked in, and so we just kind of have more energy to go out and do more. And so we've invested into that. It's all about what you want to invest into, and for us, it's experiences like this and things that make us excited and happy. But I wanted to talk to all of you guys who've been on my channel for the last few months or since KO has come out. I want to say thank you guys for all the support and the love that you guys are giving for KO. And it's been really cool to see the interactions from you guys when it comes to the highlight videos. You guys really enjoy me playing Valorant. And I don't know why, because I'm just sitting there getting my head blown off or, or just 
you know, me playing and not really know what to do. But I also love the uh, advices you guys are giving me when it comes to playing the game. And uh, someone asked me the other day, I should talk about how I got KO. Um, so I got KO when, well, where I got him, I auditioned for him through my agency back in March of 2021. His picture came in and kind of looked like what he looks like now, honestly, this with minimal changes. Um, I auditioned, I, I, I recorded myself doing one take of it, and then I was like, I didn't really like that audition because it sounded really robotic and really monotone, and I was like, this guy, the way they have him written, the lines that he's saying, I need to do, I need to make him mine. I need to, to kind of, you know, make him more flexible and make him more lively um, while still trying to keep that, you know, that tone intact. So I deleted the first, the, the audition, and then I recorded it again and uh, sent in my audition. And I got a call saying that they wanted to bring me in for KO, and they left me a really, really sweet note about my performance, my audition performance, which they don't really do, really. And in, in the, the gaming world, the audition world, you don't ever really get a note back from the casting director. You just get, you know, they love your audition and they want to hire you. That's it. It was a pretty fast turnaround. I might imagine that KO was already done and ready to go by like December or something, in terms of like what he was going to be or. December of 2020, you know, I imagine he was already maybe longer than that, actually, because um, these characters take a while to develop. Um, it's more than what you see. So I guess I just was kind of like the last finishing touches on, on, on KO and it worked out pretty well. I talked to some of the people and I do some of KO's lines and they don't believe that I'm KO. And some do some some they, they recognize my, my name and me on TikTok because some of the, the stuff that I've done with Valorant has gone viral on TikTok, which is really cool. So anyway, that's how I got KO. Uh, this has gotten a little long, but I wanted to make sure I talked about that on here in this vlog. Tonight, we're going to go out to uh, into the town and check that out. So probably going to, definitely going to bring you guys on that so you guys can see what, <laughs> what it looks like at night. See you in a bit. <laughs> Uh, kind of looking for things to add to his collection. The bigger ones? Those are nice. uh, you got a slingshot? Oh, well, let's not just, just keep moving. <laughs> Go either way. Because it's definitely the same width as the one that yeah, I had. Yeah, the, the other little night. shawl cover. Yeah, I love this one right here. That That's nice. Yeah. 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 That's beautiful. That's dope. <laughs> all right, we had to get up out of there, y'all, because it was a lot. It was getting toxic, it like on all fronts, but the air, the people. I could feel, I could feel the impurities in my pores. <laughs> they were playing my jam. I need to go to the spot. They were, they were playing Bridges Jam, so you know we had to stay there a couple more seconds just to. But we're so we're so domestic domestic domesticized domestic domesticated from Esperanza. Love yeah. things right now. Everything below zero decibels is <laughs> gonna be great. <laughs> That's lit to me now. Honestly, the older you get, the more you're yeah, like, you know, yeah. peace and quiet. Yeah. Yeah. You can't. I'm kind of vibe. This is just too much. Our last breakfast together. Oh, well, not last breakfast yeah. together, but last <laughs> breakfast here. Like women. I'm grateful that we had it. Um, and this isn't the last time, 100%. We're gonna have more experiences like this where it's like, you know, we don't wanna leave. And this has set the bar for us too. I think we're all like, all this is like, no, this is, this is what we deserve and that's what we're gonna be honey after, you know? Work hard, play hard. That's another model we just discovered. That is our model. Work hard, play hard. Right, baby? Right. Well. Well. 
massage time. The last one. The last one, because we had treatment one yesterday. So, it's Shout it. out to the Josephs. Shout out to the Josephs. I think this happened. For this treat. Um, yeah, we're sad, because we got to go back to the life we live, which <laughs> is the, this, right? <laughs> um, this place has been magnificent. And I don't know, man. I'm about to be crushed pulling into that studio, turning on all that gear. Help me! I'm about to get this massage on. It's gonna be amazing. It's gonna be amazing. It's gonna be amazing. <laughs> Last dinner. How y'all feeling? I'm so upset. We're all uh, <laughs> I'm so upset. We're all sad. But it was so much fun. Uh, next stop, Greece. Santorini. 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 Honestly, I want to see that. I would like to see that. Uh, hola. It's over. Cool. And we got to experience a lot of cool things for the first time. Hands down, the best trip we've ever taken in our lives. Hands down. The motto that we discovered this week is work hard, play hard. Working hard so we can play hard, enjoy. So we can cry hard when we have to go so home. So we can cry hard when we have to go home. But to be able to enjoy moments like this um, is, is amazing. And it's not afforded to everybody. <clears throat> and we totally understand that. But um, definitely hard work and dedication to our craft and what we do is what allows us to be here, to do to experience stuff like this. And then I get to do it with my wife, man. Like, look at her. She's beautiful. She's beautiful. Thank you guys for watching. Until next time. Bye. We should have closed it off with the Josephs. I know. Well, I got a bit of them, but I didn't get a lot of them. Okay. Say bye. Bye. Thank <laughs> you.